now we are going to talk about the or typical pneumonia which is also called as the interstitial pneumonia now in the first part of the pneumonia lecture uh, i have described uh, what is the difference between a typical and a or typical pneumonia or the interstitial and lower pneumonia so lower pneumonia is also called as typical pneumonia and interstitial pneumonia is also called as or typical pneumonia so what is the difference between them and how the question can be framed based on the uh, clinical presentation that i have described in the first lecture if you haven't seen the first uh, pneumonia lecture then you can always go and see that lecture first to know about the difference of the lower and the interstitial pneumonia now for the notes you need not to write anything the notes link will be in the description for each uh, each of the each of the my videos the notes link will be in the description in each of my videos you can always go and uh, find the notes of each topic in my each lecture so now starting with the or typical pneumonia what are the organisms which can cause this or typical pneumonia so those organisms are the mycoplasma pneumonia the chlamydophila pneumonia and shiitake the legionella species and some of the viruses like influenza corona and the respiratory syncytial virus now we will uh, get to know i mean we will uh, know only certain important mcq points about these uh, bacteria or uh, bacteria because a long question is not asked of these uh, i mean bacteria okay these are just for mcqs and that's why i have confined myself to just few important points only about this bacteria first coming to the mycoplasma pneumonia so mycoplasma pneumonia is also called as the etons agent etons agent now it has uh, some very peculiar findings in it like it is small in size like the viruses okay it is small in size like viruses and it is filtered by the bacterial filters okay uh, although it is a bacteria but it gets filtered by the bacterial fi bacterial filters okay that is a contraindicating finding in, uh, with respect to the mycoplasma pneumonia plus it is free living that is a characteristic of uh, bacteria can grow on culture media that is a characteristic of a bacteria and can be produced by binary fission so this is also a characteristic of a bacteria and exist in cocci bacilli or filamentous form so this is also a characteristic of bacteria so that's why the mycoplasma pneumonia is a bacteria okay but it lacks rigid cell wall but has triple layered cell membrane which is made up of sterol now this is a important mcq point that it lacks uh, rigid cell wall but has got triple layered cell membrane which is made up of sterol now as it is lacking this uh, cell wall that's why the beta lactams which act on the cell wall of these bacteria they are not effective in case of mycoplasma pneumonia that's why you see in pharmacology that the beta lactams are not given in case of mycoplasma pneumonia infections okay so this is the reason why beta lactams are not given in mycoplasma pneumonia infection because they are not effective na, in those cases so that's why they are not given now what is the culture used for its growth the culture that we use is the pplo growth and the pplo agar now this again is a mcq point that the culture media which is used for the growth of the mycoplasma pneumonia is the pplo growth or the pplo agar what is pplo pplo means pleuropneumonia like organism that is the other name for mycoplasma pplo is a like it is also called as etons agent so similarly it is also called as pplo also okay so it has got three names one is mycoplasma pneumonia second is etons agent and the third one is the pplo the pleuropneumonia like organism so that's why the its uh, culture media is also named on its own name that is pplo growth and pplo agar now what is the type of colony that is produced on this pplo agar so the colonies produced on this pplo agar is the very famous colonies which are the fried egg appearance colonies okay these are very famous colonies called as the fried egg appearance colonies these are called as the fried egg appearance colonies 
from these are very famous columns and this is a must must know this is very important mcq point okay now this column is can be stained by the dye ends stain and after this stain this uh, column is appear as blue color okay this column is appear as blue color so this uh, dye ends stain can be done and this column is start appearing blue color so uh, this is some important points about the mycoplasma pneumonia next we go to the next bacilli which is the legionella pneumophila so about the legionella pneumophila it is a gram negative coco bacilli it is a coco bacilli okay so it is a gram negative coco bacilli and uh, it is causing the legionnaire's disease that is nothing but the atypical pneumonia caused by legionella it has given a separate name that is legionnaire's disease some very fancy name that is legionnaire disease but still it is same it is same atypical pneumonia now what is the culture media that is selective for the legionella pneumonia it is the bc by e agar now this is also again a important mcq question it is the bc y e agar okay bc y e means buffered charcoal is extract agar so this is an important question from legionella pneumophila this is all about the atypical pneumonia or the organism which are causing this atypical pneumonia